Yo, what's going on guys? It's Tony here, aka Shady, and we are here with week number six. No, I'm sorry, week number seven of the PBA Institute. This week we're going up against Epic Pants and the coach of the Toronto Star Raptors. Any social media of his, of course, will be in the description below as always. Anyways, the standings are not updated at the moment. Um, but right now we're sitting at three and three, I think minus four. So I don't think that four and four is gonna cut it. Uh, assuming we like lose this week, win next week, and definitely 3 and 5 is not going to cut it. So, we are looking at winning both of our final two games here, of course, against this one, and then next week against Coach, I think, Diabetic Raichu, I think that's his name. Um, so, hopefully, we can do that. However, like I said, we are facing the Toronto Star Raptors 5 0, currently the second seed. We've placed the, uh, we played the number one seed. A few days ago, or a few weeks ago, I mean, uh, and we lost that one. So it's going to be a tough win this week, but hopefully we brought the right team. Hopefully we play well in the battle. So without further ado, let's uh, get into the matchup. Of course, you know our team as always. We got the Garchomp, Clefable, Scizor, Galarian, Zapdos, Raikou, Tango, Mandibuzz, him on top, Mega Blastoise, and Kangaskhan. Or as our opponent is actually right next to us. Uh, with the Aptos, Mega Maw, Wild Cinderace, Swampert, Sil Valley, Hoopa Unbound, Cuff Brigas, Kamao, Superior, Puck, and Illumise. So, with all that, let's see what the team we decided to bring was. We decided to bring a uh, Garchomp with Earthquake, Skill Shot, Outrage, and SD. Uh, Adamant, uh, I didn't see any reason to bring Jolly with his speed tiers. And we're just hoping a late game sweep. We just need to chip on a few things. Make sure that Mega Mall Wild's down. Uh, maybe check what the Savali the Savali type is. And we should just be good to sweep late game. Lumberry in case I need to set up on say like a Scalding Swampert or a Coffee with Will O Wisp. Either one of the two. And in case maybe we get like static by the Zapdos when we click outrage. Just a number of different options why that Lumberry might be useful. Next we have our Clefable here, physically defensive with Calm Mind. Very, very similar set to last week, but it seemed to like it worked pretty well against this team. As long as we should outspeed Mega Maw while, hopefully. Uh, maybe I might actually look into the, the speed of that real quick. Maybe have to invest some more speed to make sure we 100% do. But we should be outspeeding that Mega Maw while. And then kill with the flamethrower, obviously. And depending on the, like, the Savali type, this could be really good for uh, just sweeping up late game or at least putting Chip down into his team. This is a good defensive, we might be able to do with like the Komo'o, do it with the Cinderace, the Swampert, the, maybe the Hoop Unbound. Hoop Unbound is going to be very, very scary for my team to switch into, and probably just going to be kind of like a sack sort of thing. So there's that. Um, next we have a physical defensive Tangro, the Giga Drain, Earthquake, Slide Bomb, Sleep Powder. I think putting anything to sleep is going to be very, very useful against this team, whether it be, say, like the Komo'o, uh, the Zapdos, which will probably switch in. Putting the Zapdos to sleep is going to be pretty, pretty nice. Um, so that's why we're doing that. Giga Drain, obviously, for our main sap. Earthquake to hit, like, the center race of the Mega Mall while Sludge Bomb so that the Superior cannot sub up on me. Um, so yeah, there's that. Next, we have uh, Offensive Blast Toys, Water Pulse, Ice Beam, Spin, and Flip Turn. Just hits this team pretty hard. Just meant to break and hopefully set up for Guard Complete Game to Sweep. Next, we have a Specially Defensive Kangaskhan, Seismic Toss, Toxic Wish Protect. Just meant to uh, keep my team healthy, chip down his team pretty well. Um. No, I, what do I have the physical defense for? Don't remember. Why? I guess maybe Mega Maw Wild hits. That'd be my only guess. Um, so I guess that's why we're running some physical defense. And then lastly, we have Scizor here. Just um, offensive Scizor. I thought that the bullet punch is gonna be really, really nice. And I thought this would be good lore for the Komo'o. The Komo'o. I don't want it to get set up with Dragon Dances. Like belly drum set, uh, salad berries, something set like that. So I thought this would be good lore because why did, he just doesn't come out to set up every time on a scissor, I, in my opinion. Um, bullet punch, you know, U turn. I mean, it's not going to do much to him, and he'll be able to pretty much set up for free. And so I'm bringing dual wing beat to hopefully catch him off guard. I'm bringing two different toxic mons. Um, I'm really, really hoping that. Just, I can chip down his team enough with that in order to let him get fun winning game. Yeah, that's my thought process, and we'll see you guys in the battle.
Alright, we are here in the battle with Epic Pants and uh, just plugged it all and all that. Let me go look at what he decided to bring. So he brought Mega Mawile, Zapdos, Cinderace, Illumise. I didn't really prep for Illumise, but he can't baton past the Tail Glow. Maybe he's like Thunderwave Prankster, so might have to watch out for that. I don't know if Illumise gets webs, but it probably does. Uh, Swamper and then Sil Valley. So you have to figure out what Sil Valley type that is. Gotta weaken the Zapdos up a bit. Making the Swampert, check this out, Valley, and then Garchomp should be able to do the sweep thing late game. Um, so no Hoopa, no Kofagrigid, no Kamo, oh, no Serp, no Muck. No Hoopa's crazy good for me. Um, I feel like just leading last choice is fine. The worst case, he leads with a bad so Valley type. Um, I'm gonna lead Blastoise. Okay, he leads Cinderace, that's great for me. We're gonna Mega Evolve and we're just gonna flip turn here, completely free. No Hoopa is amazing. Um, no Kofi Rigas is pretty nice for Garchomp sweep. He's just gonna U-turn out. Yeah, that did a lot. Blastoise, so 28 from that. Uh, from a Cinderace. U-turn. Is he gonna show that he's Libero? I don't. Yeah, I don't want. Bro. So Cinderace. I don't wanna want the bro. I'm about to change that every single time. They took 28 from U turn. Wow that did a lot. 28? That banded I think. Choice band? Jolly, maybe? And a low roll. Uh yeah, that's a jolly banded Cinderace, okay. So he's gonna go into Swamper and he took 18% the flip turn. Uh, okay, so he's like a Spadef Swamper. I think Clefable's free here? That or I just go Tangrowth and I think I'm gonna go Tangrowth and just Sleep Powder here. I, he, there's no way he stays in. I get a free sleep on everything. Best case is probably gonna be Zapdos here. Um, or the Savali. Gonna get rocks up. I guess he. Oh, I missed. Okay. Guess he thought I'd over predict. Uh, which sucked because I could have Giga Drain pretty much for free there. Um, and I don't have a defogger on this team, do I? I have spin on stories. Okay. I want to just sleep at her again. I really do. Dude, are you kidding me? Yeah, I knew he'd think I'd kick it during that turn. Um. I don't know, dude. <laughs> I don't. Now it's like a 50 50. Obviously, the thing's gonna be Rindo, Mirko. How much does Rindo take? Like, can I just, like, sludge bomb and maybe get, like, a, like, a, um, just, like, make sure you get drink kills with, um, what's that one called? Tangrowth. How much do I need? Why oh, it eats it. I would need so much chip on it. Whatever, we'll sleep powder a third time. Actually, I'm a Giga Drain. I should have sleep powdered again. Mother... The man, but that's good. Swampert's pretty weakened here. Uh, how much do I need for Earthquake to kill with um, Garchomp? Earthquake at plus two. It's pretty much in range already. It's gonna go into Illumise. I don't know what this thing does. I don't know what Illumise does here. Um, like I said, he's probably gonna be like prankster. Status. Let me see what status moves it gets. It could set up screens here. Uh, tailway, tailwind. Doesn't seem to get ton. It could toxic me, I guess. I'm gonna go into Clefable, I guess. That or Kangaskhan. Or Scizor. I like Scizor here. We we'll go Scizor. If he throws away me, that's fine, I guess. He's gonna encore me. Okay, okay. 
so I think he might try to T-wave me here. So if he T-waves me, does Illumise say drop here to Garchomp if I try to predict that? Illumise versus Garchomp. I should just kill with an Outrage, but I don't want to lock myself into Outrage. So, like I said, I think he Thunder Waves here. Whatever, we're, I'm fine with this thing getting Thunder Waves. I actually really want a Toxic. Um, but we'll scout what he does first. Will you turn out first? He's going to go into Zapdos, so I do wish I Toxic, but that's fine. He is static, so that's something to be mindful of. I'm just going to go into... This encores me into Calm Mind if I go into... So I can't do that just yet. Um, we're going to go into Kang here. And we're going to fire off a Toxic and see what he wants to do. If he subs, that's fine. I should break it with Estos. He's going to Volt Switch. And do 24 to my King is Khan. This Khan took 24 from a Zapdos Volt Switch. That's offensive for sure. I'm going to go into Mawile here. Um... I don't want this thing to have a sub up. Psst, having a sub would be terrible. And with rocks up, I just... That's fine. I don't really need this or anything, to be honest. We're just going to seismic toss and see what you want to do. I don't want this thing to have a sub up. We have speed, which is good. He is going to sub. It was my Clefable speed. Okay, so he doesn't have to beat this. Or, I mean, he could, but I don't know. You're going to miss a play rough. Okay. That's a little tough for him, for sure. I really want a Toxic predicting a swap out. I don't know if that's worth though. I really want a Toxic on a swap out, but I mean, Side McCloud just does so much to everything on his team. We'll find out probably what Savali type he is here. So we'll, so we'll S-Toss again. I'm gonna play rough me, because we should live it. How much does Sucker do? How, how much? Sucker Punch is going to do, because this is an attacking move, right? Yeah. Uh, Mawile. Mawile here. Versus... Wait, okay, player up to like 80, right? 80. Yes, yeah, so that's just a max attack adamant. So I think he suckers here. We're going to toss up a wish. Now he's going to Fire Fang. Okay. Good prediction. Um, but I didn't need that, like I said. I think going choice is fine here. We'll get it healthy. We can get a spin off here. Do we kill with the rapid spin here? I doubt it. Uh, no. But we should be able to take a hit, right? Seventy percent, seventy-one. No, we won't be able to take it. But we can at least get it healthier. That invites Zapdos in though, and then he gets a free Volt Switch off. Um. Batter, I can go Garchomp right now, but I don't want to do that just yet. I can go Scizor. I don't know if I'll speed, though. I can go Tangrowth. I think I'm just going to go in the Blastoise here. Just get my health back up. We can't spin. We won't kill. I don't want a flip turn. I do want this for myself. So we're just going to Ice Beam here and pick up the KO. Ice Beam kills, right? I just assume it does. Yeah, I should just be able to pick up the KO. I really want to spin, but I just... Can't risk it. Can't risk this thing staying in and killing me. Yeah. We'll get the wish off here. But not as advice in Zapdos, unfortunately. I think we think it's Miracle Blastoise. Kind of want to run Miracle Blastoise one week. That'd be cool, I think. Okay, he's going to go Zapdos here. And of course, he does kill. And my switch in is gone for the game. So now it becomes what do I sack against this thing? I really just want these hazards off the field. I mean, I live any hit from this thing. Thunderbolt. I might need this to live a hit from Cinderace. That's the only problem. I really just want to spin, though, and get these hazards off the field. The Rocker is Swampert, though, and he can just get him up for free again. I don't need Scizor. Can Scizor take a hit well? Not really after rocks. Whatever, we'll just stay in and we'll spin. I want. I really want the rocks off. I helped bed this thing. Did he click a minus priority move? No, he's just, I guess, bulky offensive. 
did not expect to outspeed this thing, not gonna lie. And we outspeed uh, Cinderace here if he goes into it. Worst case, he goes Illumise here and he gets an Encore off. Yeah, he's gonna try to Encore me. Um, I wanna say I predict that, but there's no point. Um, we're just gonna go into Scissor here. Nice that we got the spin off. Worst case, he doubles into Swampert here. I really want to predict that. He's, he's made a prediction. But the thing is, if this Illumise has U-turn, then it just does nothing for me. Why didn't he click it last time? Why did he not click it? Because I went hard scissor. And I guess he didn't want to take a hit. I really want to predict him going hard swamper here. That's what I really, really want to do. I really want to predict him to go hard swamper. I mean, I can outrage for free. But the thing is, Zapdos is kind of scary. And I don't know what Sobaliad is yet. I really want to predict that swamper coming in right now. I really want to predict the Swampert coming in. We're going to do it. We're going to predict the Swampert going in. What should I be doing with the Swampert? For the two shot, that's great. Uh, Not really. I'm going to flip turn, actually. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Uh, now we'll go hard scissor here. Okay, so he does. He actually has Toss. It's funny. Uh, he does. He, no, I have Toxic. He doesn't yet. So I really want a Toxic on one of these two coming in. Either the Zapdos, the Swampert, maybe the Savali. We don't know what Savali type that is. I feel like it might be. I don't know what type it'd be for my team right now. Maybe Steel. Maybe a second Steel type. I don't know. I'd have to look at what my team is and see what would be the best for him. Glad I got that play right though. I'm glad I got that off. Um, Terry and Toxic here. And then, like I said, it's either going to go off on the Swampert or the Zapdos. If it goes Swampert, that kind of sucks. But I mean, if it goes Swampert, that's fine. We can U turn out in the Blastoise and get a spin off again. Uh, we should be fine to do that. That was a slow Zapdos, though. That was before the spin, right? Yeah, up before spin. So that's a slow Zapdos. What does he do here? He's probably trying to see if I overpredict or something like that. Okay, he's going to go for the S-Toss. I'm going to Toxic here. I'm going to go Wing Beat. Oh, yeah, it's Bed Me. I just realized that. Um, does Illumise drop to a bullet punch here? I don't know. I think U-turn's fine though, because he's in outrage. Outrage. Range. Um, I'm just scared of that Savali, dude. I don't know what that Savali is. I can also go... Hmm. We're just gonna U turn here. That already encores me into Toxic. I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try to U turn here. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Go Cinderace here. And like I said, he's banded. He's banded Cinderace. Definitely banded Cinderace, I think. Uh, it's a choice band, Jolly. Uh, and then not Libero. I gotta get rid of that. Versus Stoist. I should just die to anything on this, from this thing. 41. Um, yeah, probably die to everything. But he at least locks himself into something. And then I can go Garchomp. Um, that or I can go Cinderace here. But he probably has Iron Head though. Or, I mean, sorry, I can go Blastoise. Or, I mean, Clefable, sorry. I can go Clefable, but he probably... Oh, my God, Powerball just does a lot in general. Uh, So, we're going to go into Blastoise here. 
and just see what he locks himself into. Um, I mean, you get a free flip turn because it should just kill a Cinderace, right? Uh, maybe not, but it's alright. It's fine. We're going to flip turn here. We're going to high jump kick and kill. That's fine. We're going to go into Clefable. And do we just start setting up? No, 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 no. I think this is where we go into Garchomp. And we just... Outrage. Outrage kills us max HP Zapdos, right? Um, from Garchomp. Yeah, we should just two-shot with Outrage. We're going to click Outrage here. Because I don't want to go for SD. Because he's going to go Illumi and he'll just Encore me into it. And he lives on one. Oh, but the Toxic. That sucks. And he's still Valley Fairy. Oh, man. Did I just... Did I just lose my... So, my... Okay, 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 okay. Uh, what do I do with this information? I mean, we have Tangrowth in the back right now. Can Tangrowth just live a hit? Oh, uh, this is... So Valley Fairy. Versus... Tangrowth right now. Multi-attack at plus two. We live, we can just get a Sleep Powder off. So I think we just have to... Go into Scizor and Sack here. Flame charge. Okay. Now we go ten growth here, and we can just sleep powder. And as long as we land, we should be fine. And then, okay, gonna go for another SD. I. Okay. That sucks. That's probably a game there. Wow, dude, I missed three sleep powders. Are you kidding me? We're gonna make it four. Finally, dude. Holy. Okay, so Sludge Bomb should two shot this thing. As long as he doesn't get first turn sleep, we win. Oh, wow. I mean, we just sacked this thing, dude. Um, right? Or do we sack Clefable? I think we sack Clefable. Now we Sludge Bomb again, dude. We're gonna Giga Drain here. That or we go Garchomp here? No, they go for multi attack, not flame charge. Uh, that's that's a stupid play. Uh, we just hope that he stays asleep. Cool. That's like, good. We deserve that because we missed like three or four of them. Three Giga Drains. They're not Giga Drain. Three Sleep Headers. So I think that's well deserved. Uh, if we sack here, um, as he clicks Pyro, I think we should be fine. Okay, I think we just sack. Oh, he clicks U turn here though. He clicks U turn to kill. Um, in which case Clefable's good against both of his mons. So we're gonna go Clefable. He clicks U-turn, right? He clicks high Pyro Ball. I think I might have just choked this game with that. Um, that's fine. We're gonna soft boil here. Okay. We're gonna Moon Blast. We already know he choice banded. We'll stop oil again on the off chance he misses. That's good because we can't get toxic. And, well, I mean, toxic matters. Never mind. Uh, so we should be able to go into Garchomp here. We know he's banded. And at that point, we can just we just SD here. SD and then skill shot into something. Right. I don't see how that's why that's not the play. The Cinderace can't kill me with anything, right? Cinderace doesn't get anything to kill uh, Garchomp. Choice Band. It should be able to kill with anything. So I think we just SD. I don't think this thing gets anything to kill me. Well, if I SD here and he just stays in the Pyro Balls, he two shots me. So I think I actually have to scale shot first. Or I just earthquake or outrage. I can lock myself in outrage. I think we're gonna outrage. Yeah. Oh, he missed anyway. So if I had, if I had, um, so if I had SD or skill, yeah, if I had SD, I won that game or won the game here. But he's gonna go swampert here. We're gonna outrage again. I would prefer two turn lock. 
but we'll see. Okay, cool. We got two turn, and we're lumped. I forgot about that. You can earthquake me. Um, what do we do here? We SD. Yeah, I think we SD. Um, I think we SD into skill shot in case that scarf zapped us. Yeah, we live. We skill shot and a chance that scarf zap. Dose. Oh, we might have choked the game away. We might have just choked the game away. That's uh, tough. Okay. Our best chance. Oh my god, did we just choke this game away? This is this is terrible. Okay, so we're gonna sleep powder here. We're gonna just try to sleep powder. Try to pick up the win. Nope, it's gonna be heat wave. Uh, where you scarf Zapdos? Where you scarf Zapdos? If he wasn't scarfed, then we ch okay. Okay, cool. Uh, okay, so I did make the right play by clicking it there. I just got unlucky. That was probably the axiest game of the season. And like that, I think our season is over. Uh, hopefully, by the next time I play my week, by the time I play my week eight game, I the doc will be updated so I can see just how much of a chance I really do have at playoffs going into the final week. Because it might just end up memeing if that's the end of it. Uh, but anyways, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. <laughs> if you guys did enjoy, make sure you want to see more of the content, make sure to hit that like button, and of course subscribe. This has been Tony and I'm out.